Stop walking, Sigur. soundtrack first came, it did help so much young fellows. It really gave them an idea, thinking about what can we do, and seeing all this every year, and think about themselves, hey, surely we can do that, eh? Every time they just like find a box or a tin of flower and just bang, 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 bang pretending to sing and all that and move. But I always say to them kids when I see them playing, kids, you need to go to school every single day and there's sand tracks coming. And then you'll be rocking. And the kids get really happy, they're all waiting. They're washing, pretending to dance, hanging around, thinking, oh yes. So it's really, really good and it's a good opportunity for young kids to see that for them growing up and finishing school and going into like music, and one day they'll be one of that. So this is a good thing, showing young kids that they can do it. Sandtracks came out of a demonstrated unmet need in remote Aboriginal communities who were really keen to have high profile contemporary Aboriginal bands touring to their communities. Um, we found in 2004-2008 we had toured Nabalek Band from Arnhem Land and audiences had followed the tour. They'd travelled hundreds of kilometres to see the tour. They'd crossed state borders. And so when we spoke with people in remote Aboriginal communities, they said to us they really wanted to have these high profile bands, but they also wanted to develop their own local musicians and local bands. And so Soundtrax was created as a result of that. <laughs> So the way that Soundtracks works is a number of high profile Aboriginal bands are invited to list in the menu. We create a menu that goes out to the communities and they vote for the band that they would most like to have touring to their community. Each year Music NT hosts uh, the Bush Bands Business and Bush Bands Bash where young community bands come together for a three day workshop and then an enormous performance uh, in, in Alice Springs. From that group, one band is then invited to tour in the following year's Sandtrax. One of the real delights of Sandtrax is the progress of the bands and the musicians over the years. Uh, 2011 Sunshine Reggae Band toured with Narbalek. They had a terrific tour, they went off and did some other things, got some more experience. But they changed their name, they became Chintu Band, but they were subsequently invited back to tour as the headline artists by the communities. What's really great is to see them mentoring the next generation. Nabalek Band, the band that started all of this, has been invited to return as the profile band on the Soundtracks tour several times. What was particularly exciting in the most recent tour is that the young band that had come through the Bush Band's business process was Black Rock Band, many of which the band members are children of the Narbalek band. So we've seen a generation of musicians now starting to come through. One of the things that's great about Soundtrax is the community ownership that happens. This year, Willarara Creative, who regularly partner with us in presenting the show. They approached us about designing the marketing material. They designed the poster and the tour t-shirts for this performance and there was a great sense of delight and pride in that and we'd really like to see that ownership continue and grow. Good to see you my dancing girl. First tour we went for soundtrack was 
And uh, my name, Daniel Wolfani. This year, 2018, is, is, is more different. So I got my original band, Saltwater Band. And I feel more like happy because I got my son singing with me and the deadly boys that are playing my music. I look back to when I first came and I saw a lot of band and I see I see it myself. I used to be like that. And the boys like the Ruchu band and I want your band and Tupi band. I was talking to them. Hey boys, we got Big concert coming up. So when you when you're on stage, just prove yourself, like confidence, like talk to the crowd, dance, singing, make the band happy and make them live. Then I saw them in three years after and they got all deadly song. Cause I seen it ah now they good band and professional musician, you know? Because I was giving them my story, you know? I feel very proud that I'm doing soundtrack tour with the countrymen from Jebru, eh? Black Rock Band. We're friends, you know, in Arnhem Land side. People in the district can listen and see that we've got the style of Arnhem Land from salt water, from fresh water. Yeah. I reckon this is the best soundtrack tour this year. I'm gonna go on the stage, like rocking, make people happy so they can get up and dance and smile and happy to listen to my voice and my band to share our music and just sing for the crowd.